Hello, let us hope that you are doing well. Welcome to AZ Tips channel. Today we are going to talk about water. We are going to, to focus on the reason why it is unsafe to drink deionized water, DI or DM water in abbreviations. Let us thank those who made subscribes, likes, shares, and gave us comment on different topics we had talked about. We also suggest you to give us many subscribes, likes, shares, and comments on the topics we always used to talk about. It is usually okay to drink a small amount of deionized water, but there are several reasons why it would be unsafe to drink a large volume of DI or to drink deionized water as your, your only form of water. Deionized water, abbreviated DI or DM, is water from which the ions have been removed. Ordinarily, water contains many ions such as copper 2 plus, calcium 2 plus, magnesium 2 plus, and hydrogen carbonate ions. It is also better to know that these ions are most commonly removed using an ion exchange process, reverse osmosis, and electrode ionization or simply electrode ionization. Hydrogen carbonates can be removed by heating ionized water. Some selective chemicals can be used in the process of demineralization of water, but the selection of these chemicals depends on the intended use of DM water, for example, pharmaceutical industry water, demineralization, steam power plant, water demineralization, agriculture inputs, industry water demineralization, and so on. Let us talk about one example. Bactericide chemicals, usually hypochlorites, bisulfites, usually which are used as deoxidizers, it means those who prevent against oxidation of internal structure of the pipes during the process. Phosphate of esters, which are used as scaring inhibitors, it means those who prevent against deposit of scare and scam in internal parts of the, the membranes, especially in the case of reverse osmosis membranes, sodium hydroxide and ammonia, which are used as acidobasic regulator systems. These chemicals can be used in the mineralization of steam power plant GM water. The same chemicals cannot be used in the case of pharmaceutical industries DM water due to toxicity of some of them, like ammonia, or these scaring inhibitors. Deionized water may be used in laboratory situations where the presence of ions would cause interference or other problems. It is also important to note that deionized water is not necessarily pure water. The purity depends on the composition of the source of water. Deionizing water or simply deionizing does not remove pathogenic or organic contaminants. Let us first ask ourselves this question. Why drinking deionized water is unsafe? Aside from its unpleasant taste, and sensation in your mouth, there are good reasons to avoid drinking deionized water. 
Generally, deionized water lacks minerals normally found in water which have beneficial health effects. Those are like calcium, magnesium, uh, which are in particularly desirable minerals in water. Deionized water aggressively attacks pipes and storage containers materials. Uh, this is done by reaching metals and other chemicals into the water. Drinking deionized water may also lead to an increase of risk of metal toxicity both because deionized water reaches metals from pipes and containers and because hard or mineral water protects against absorption of other metals by the body. Use of DI for cooking can also lead to loss of minerals in food into the cooking water. At least one study found ingestion of the ionized water directly damaged the intestinal mucosa. Other studies did not observe this. De there is substantial evidence that drinking deionized water disrupts minerals homeostasis. Homeostasis is maintaining of water equilibrium in our body. Long-term use of deionized water as drinking water may also cause an organ damage even if additional minerals are present elsewhere in the diet. There is evidence that distilled or DI water are less likely to quench thirst. Deionized water may contain contamination in the form of bits of ion exchange resin. While deionized water made from distilled or reverse osmosis Purified water may be pure. Deionizing no portable water will not make it safe to drink. What if you drink deionized or de demineralized water? Experts have tested deionized distilled water and it, it does not taste good. According to experts, it feels strange or prickly on the tongue but it did not cause any burns or dissolve tissues in their mouth. If locked in a rub storage room with the choice between other solvents, DI or demineralized water or simply heavy water, the deionized water is less dangerous but there are a couple of ways to make it safe. Those are First of all, let the DI react with air. The water readily picks up, up ions from the atmosphere, quickly tuning into the ordinary purified water. Second, don't let the deionized water run through pipes or glassware that has been accounted nasty chemicals. In other words, don't give the DI a chance to reach toxic metals or chemicals from its container. Number three, rest the water settles and avoid drinking the portion at the bottom. Although not a proven fact, it is possible that any iron exchange resin beds would sink to the bottom of the container and it's better not to take this risk. An alternative would be to run the deionized water through a filter. Don't use breached coffee filter or paper towel, however or you will likely to reach more dioxin 
into the water than remove potentially dangerous resin. Further readings or references, you can consult these stations. Number one, it is an article from World Health Organization. It is a citation written by Frantisek Kosiesek with the title Health Risks from Drinking Demineralized Water. National Institute of Public Health, Czech Republic. This article was published on 16 September 2015. Another reading is a, read, is a reading from U.S. Food Drugs Administration with the title Guide to Inspections of High Purity Water Systems. High Purity Water Systems. Concert page 7 out of 93 pages uh, and this station was published in 2009. The last you can also consult European Medicine Agency. Then, then you will see where there is a note for guidance on the quality of water for pharmaceutical use. This, this article was published in London in 2002. Thank you for watching.